Where are you from? Mm, I'm from the southern part of India. Oh. Uh, the state, like uh, the state's name is Tamil Nadu. <laughs> yeah, I live there. <laughs> uh, so, do you have any cultural shock when you come to Taiwan? Yeah. Uh, initially, I came uh, for the first time. I came here during my uh, like, uh, PhD. But I know uh, Taiwan's culture is is actually uh, more different uh, from the culture we have in um, our part, like our India. So, yeah. <laughs> so what's your favorite part of maybe Taiwan's culture or anything? Culture? Anything you like about Taiwan? Yeah, uh, they're very friendly. You're like, okay, you are very friendly. <laughs> I feel like uh, it's like my home, uh, not because of the, the, the culture is totally different, but still I feel like this mm. is my home. <laughs> That's amazing. Yeah, and also Taiwanese people, we like the cinema culture of India, Hollywood. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think I, the I, most famous Indian movie in Taiwan is Three Idiots. Three you know Idiots, yeah, yeah, yeah. So do you think, what is the best thing in India? If anyone they want to maybe move or live in India, do you think yeah, what is the things you like? Actually, if you if you want to mm, like observe uh, various kinds of culture, you you can visit India. At the same time, mm, India is like mm, it is it is. Um, to me, okay. To me, I feel like India is um, uh, not very progressive uh, oh. when it comes to the again when it comes to the culture. We still have a, a caste society, you know, caste, right? Oh, oh so, still caste yes, system still. Still, exists. we have a, it's a caste society um, where like uh, there is a huge discrimination. Oh. Everywhere. Yeah. For example, for instance, uh, a person will skill for eating beef, <laughs> or oh. like a girl and boy, if if they are uh, choosing like a life together, uh, and if it is allowed uh, between different castes, oh, then so they they'll marry. yeah they they'll they'll uh, like they'll kill you. <laughs> wow. So all these things are still prevailing in India and now it is, a, is, it is at a very uh, increasing state. Yeah. So yeah, I India's culture is totally, uh, to when it compares, when you compare it to the Taiwanese culture, even I know Taiwanese culture is progressing in last few years, few oh. uh, decades, I know. Like even here there was some patriarchy, but now it is changing. But in India, the change is very small. Maybe so, because the population is too huge, so not not need the population more alone. The point is like uh, basically the society is hierarchical, uh, and it is very rigid. Not because of population, oh. the, the hierarchy is rigid. So many. How about for uh, Indian young people? How can they change their life? Because maybe in India it's like a pyramid. How to climb to a upper upper level? Do they this? Just like maybe the movie three years, maybe students are very competitive right, to study math or anything to ch become maybe engineer, okay. something like that. So, how would you maybe suggest Indian young people like uh, to to like to have a better life? Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> By education. Oh, education. Uh, how like people treat each other. I want my country to uh, like. I want and people like us to uh, throw this hierarchy to the trash <laughs> and like consider everyone as human beings uh, and like. Yeah, 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 yeah. That is very, very important because that shows the real uh, development mm. of a country, not in building uh, like. Building a very big uh, mall, yeah, or or like uh, building a uh, making a hundred trillion business. That's not the real um, development, right? Yeah. So the the real development is in human minds, 
which which always you wish to we should wish to uh, treat uh, the other person equally <laughs> so i i i wish the young india young people of like us will change it will change the present scenario oh. and yeah is <laughs> a great suggestion yeah, actually th that's what i feel we, we should do that because uh, india is a beautiful country mm. um, but like we want people also to be beautiful right mm. <laughs> yeah yeah i heard uh, bangalore is like a indian silicon valley yeah yeah we have many IT companies, electronic industries, um, at Bangalore. Mm. Um, yeah, it's it's, uh, and also um, the climate is very good in Bangalore. Mm. <laughs> it's very cool so when compared to the other part of South in India. In Bangalore, there are also so many people from different countries, like international. Yeah, it it it, it is a international city. I have been there twice or thrice. Uh, uh, actually, my brother. Uh, my own brother is living there. Uh, other metropolitan cities, you will have, you will find it in Bangalore. But the only issue is it is having a heavy traffic. Oh, like Bangalore is a city with heavy traffic. So if you want to move for some 10 kilometers, then you have to spend three or four hours. <laughs> oh, and also I think Taiwan they uh, collaborate with Indian like industry technology as well for example maybe semiconductor stuff yeah, yeah. Taiwan is trying to maintain a good relationship with India and oh. India too uh, India wants to uh, wants Taiwan to invest in India mm. it's trying to make a collaboration with Taiwan yeah. like Taiwan uh, semiconductor industries yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and also India your official language is English and Hindi maybe no uh, 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 India has almost more than 20 official languages. Oh. Uh, a state has a different language. Our, our, all our states are uh, separated based on languages. Okay, so oh. we have 32 states. So obviously, like we have more oh, than 32 great. official <laughs> languages. So if maybe one day you have kids, where do you want your kids to study? Maybe in Western country or in India or in Asian countries. Mm. It, uh, like it depends. Like uh, we have not uh, talked of that, but uh, I wish to settle in. Uh, like there are there are like two versions which I wanted to do. One I wanted to uh, have a job in India. Mm. Mm. So that is like it is to uh, it is good to work in our own country, right? Yeah. At the same time, like now the economic situation, the financial situation in India is a bit bad. So uh, especially the job opportunities are very less. So, yeah. About US. U.S. Uh, personally, I I don't uh, prefer U.S. Why? Uh, I prefer Europe. Uh, yeah, because uh, U.S. Uh, like all my colleagues who work there, uh, they say like uh, it's it's like it's a bit pressurizing when compared to the Euro. So yeah, I want to be in Europe uh, because uh, again my friends there in Europe uh, they enjoy their job. Because it is not very pressurizing, uh, and it is like easy to go. Uh, uh, we can do our work relaxed, right? Oh so yeah, peaceful life. Yeah, <laughs> that is what we expect. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Good for you. Nice to meet you. <laughs>